Just got home from work and look what's here. Know your farmer, eat better meat. Crowd cow. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Tara, a farmer from Northern California. This channel is mainly about farming, but sometimes it's not. I recently got a box of meat. It's actually a subscription box called Crowd Cow. And on their website, they actually show where the meat comes from, which I think is so cool. So tonight for dinner, AJ is going to make some of their New York steaks. We got a couple New York steaks. And then one of my favorite side dishes that I make is bacon and Brussels sprouts. I am so bad about eating vegetables, and when you throw bacon on it, that makes everything better, right? I'm actually gonna show you guys my little recipe that I make. Um, I'm not as good as Meredith when it comes to cooking, if you guys follow this farm wife, but I'm gonna give it a go, and I'll show you guys the meat. If you guys are interested in Crowd Cow, there is going to be a link in the description below. It is completely customizable. So they have all different kinds of meat, some stuff that's already been pre-seasoned, which is really nice if you just wanna get things done fast. But I mean, I ordered some buffalo burgers, which I like, I love, or bison burgers, love bison burgers. Got some of those, got some ground beef, got the steak, got chicken. I kinda got a little bit of everything, which is so nice. Like I said, it's a subscription box, gets delivered right to your door. And they are offering $15 off your first order and 5% off everything else. I'm really enjoying this. It's another thing that is just making my life so much easier. So hit the link in the description below if you want to check them out. And I hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so here is my attempt at showing you guys a little cooking video with the bacon I got from Crowd Cow and Brussels sprouts. Another little fun fact for you guys, I actually never owned a cast iron skillet until Meredith told me to buy one. So I'm going to be using my larger cast iron skillet. The cast iron skillet is really nice for this recipe because it is partially on the stovetop and partially in the oven. So that way you don't have to move dishes or anything or pans. You just stick the cast iron right in the oven. So I definitely cheat a little bit and buy these bags of Brussels sprouts and everything has already been halved and cut. But if you just buy fresh Brussels sprouts, the first thing you want to do is wash them and cut them in half. So like I said, I cheat. You want to take your bacon and we're going to slice it into little pieces. So here's my little cooking tip. If you guys have kitchen scissors that are like, I only use these for meat and stuff. I actually just cut my bacon like this instead of slicing it. So yeah, I just will basically one handed here. It actually goes a lot faster than slicing it um, when I have two hands. And then we're just gonna throw the bacon into the pan. Okay, so if you haven't already cut up the Brussels sprouts, this is a great time to do that. And you also wanna preheat the oven to 375 degrees. Now that the bacon is done, you wanna use a slotted spoon and take all the bacon out but leave the bacon grease behind. Next, you're gonna add those Brussels sprouts straight into the bacon grease. Hi, P-Dog. 
So this is where the cast iron comes in handy. It's gonna sit on the stove top for about six minutes. Then it's gonna go directly into the oven for about 15 minutes. After those 15 minutes, we're gonna mix the bacon back in with the Brussels sprouts. It's gonna do a final 10 minutes in the oven and then we're gonna be all done and voila, we've got Brussels sprouts and bacon.